The BJP is under scrutiny as opposition leaders, including TMC's Mahua Moitra, received Apple alerts about state-sponsored attackers targeting their iPhones. This triggered demands for a parliamentary IT committee meeting to investigate the issue. The BJP responded by dismissing the claims and suggesting a link between the alerts and George Soros-funded Access Now. Apple clarified its stance, stating that uh, it doesn't attribute threat notifications and cannot provide details on their origins. Member of the Economic Advisory Council of the Prime Minister, Sanjeev Sanyal, further suggested that Access Now, linked to George Soros, might be sending the messages, raising questions about external agencies accessing the system. The BJP's Amit Malviya pointed to Soros's financial ties and questioned the opposition's motives, implying a political agenda. Apple added to the complexity by acknowledging the possibility of false alarms and highlighting the challenges in detecting state-sponsored attacks. The episode deepens political divides and raises concerns about cybersecurity, foreign links influencing domestic affairs, and the potential for political motivations behind the alerts. The exchange also invoked past instances of surveillance as highlighted by Amit Malviya, further underscoring the complexity of the situation. As the narrative unfolds, the opposition's concerns, the BJP's counter-narrative and the broader implications for cybersecurity and political dynamics, especially with George Soros' name coming into the picture, it has come to the forefront, creating a complex and multifaceted scenario. Subscribe to One India channel and never miss an update.